And welcome from the tram in. We are not in London, so I'm gonna open this vlog up a little bit differently. We are in Gothenburg. So we're on our way to the exhibition center. Um, back in September, when Therese and I got married, a few friends of ours um, gave us two uh, tickets for the Gothenburg half marathon, and that's why we're here for the weekend. Picking up the race bibs and the race is tomorrow on Saturday at a very, very uncommon usual time. It starts at, um, our, our slot is like 3.30 and supposedly it's going to be 25 degrees. <laughs> and, and what? the world's biggest half marathon. Well, <laughs> so we're just checking out the list of the running events with the most participants and in terms of, because they're listing all different distances, in terms of half marathon, 60,000 people in 2011, um, Gothenburg makes the biggest half marathon. And here, right next to the exhibition center, we have uh, Lisa Berge, which is an amusement park, right in the city center heart of Gothenburg. Numalapa. <laughs> Ja, det stämmer. Och han har numret efter det sen. Jag är Daniel. Där. Tack så jättemycket. Therese, can you pull out one of the official race shirts that we obviously not get given? What does varit mean? Run? Lap. Lap? Yeah. All right. It's a Gothenburg lap. Gothenburg lap. It's just one lap. Oh guys, over here is a stand uh, for the veteran wonder that 180 mile bike ride um, i did like two years ago unfortunately i wasn't vlogging back then um, very epic ride so i just talked to reese into this beautiful a new balance shoe i wear like the v3 if you watched one of my older vlogs super light actually an olympic edition here limited edition you can only buy here um in case you're wondering 700 is like 65 quid pounds Cool. While well, Cerise is paying, I'm super tempted to get another set like of those Falke socks. They are absolutely amazing. Um, I'll be running in, in, in one tomorrow and I ripped one in two pieces, unfortunately. What else have we got over here? Trex, you run on clouds. And guys, I just got myself a new pair of glasses. It's pretty cool, you can pay by Swish, just type in the mobile number and that's how you pay. Oh, we've gone shopping here. Our t-shirt's black. Everything's black. I'd go for black. Alright, that was the expo. Um, if you like that one. We bought two things, three things. And now I'm gonna get some dinner and yeah given that the race is only I get 3.30 it's actually quite nice, not super stressing, chill. super chill, not stressing out by getting up early, what to eat. Um, that's cool. With the race entry you can use public transport the whole weekend for free. In case you're wondering what we're eating, we've got risotto, Therese got the pasta. Just a bit of an update here, um, it is just past 10 o'clock, look at the sky, still very bright, it's 10.20. Midsummer is um, on its way, another month. This guy just won the massive tweaks like at the amusement park, that's so cool. Alright, we're back at the hotel. Guys, tomorrow I think we'll be running across that bridge. That's awesome. And that was getting room service. Teresa is so used to room service. <laughs> unbelievable, it's absolutely unbelievable. This is a very chill. Um, yeah, anyway, the elites have already started. Uh, <laughs> and 
and yeah, we're having lunch now. Got some waste footage for you here. All right, um, one and a half hours to waste start. We're heading to the start line. Behind us on the bridge, you can probably see a few runners. There's 25 different start slots, so and we're like in 21st. Here's what we were given, guys, by the way. Therese yeah. got a runaway bride. <laughs> there she is. Um, and I've got runaway groom. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, um, no public transport it is. Um, and given, so we have to walk to the start line. I don't know how far it is. But guys, given that, won't be able to carry the, um, the camera with me on my run. Uh, this is the race footage that you're going to get. Free race. Keep it up, runners! <laughs> Well then, buddy! <laughs> oh, I love the race spirit. Here's the supporters chilling. Great day today. Alright, some more pre race race footage here. Great day for not only the runners but also the spectators here. A lot of bars. Reminds me a bit like of the Chicago Marathon. Approaching the start line um, now, taking us a little bit longer um, to walk. Anyway, they're already finishing, you know, a few of them. So let's see where the backdrop is. Dixie Paradise. And the warm up crew. So that looks like the backdrop area, guys. Warm up lap. Um, Running room and bike, gotta say hello now. Uh, got to say running bride and running room, gotta say hello because we gotta drop the bag and the camera. We we'll see you, wish us good luck, and we'll see you right after the race. Alright, guys, that was Rothenberg Half Marathon. I'm approaching the finish line as well. I finished a few minutes earlier in 1.35. No PB here, but please, because it was a very, very crowded race. Um, given that we started like in group 21 out of 25, didn't make it better or easier. It's then way for me to go down. But anyway, I'm pleased. Let's see what Therese is. Um, and here's the metal guys, by the way. Metal, 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 metal. Other than that, um, beautiful voice and great finish here as well. Finish. All right, guys, it's the next <laughs> uh, day. It's another stunning day in Gothenburg. We are just chilling out. Must have a little bit sore. Going to a restaurant. I hope you enjoyed that vlog. Gothenburg is such a beautiful city. Should you ever be there, highly, highly recommend it. Other than that, hope you like the vlog. You have a wonderful day wherever you are. I hope I'm gonna see you in the next vlog again. Take care, guys.